Hey everyone, welcome back, and remember... Anytime you're bored, just pull out your iPhone. You can make music anywhere with your iPhone. Follow Lyle Trash on Instagram. Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in to another episode of How to Make Music on Your iPhone. I am your host, Lyle Trush. So let's just jump right in here. So the first thing you want to do is obviously download the Figure app by Propeller Heads on the iTunes Store. When you open up the app, it's going to give you a little tutorial, but the first step is to just start a new song by clicking on the plus tab. Tap the blue drum tab on the bottom left. Play around with this for a second and just check it out. Next, tap the bass tab, check it out, and the lead tab. Down below are the tweaks you can edit. There's the, just the levels. Let's start with a bass. It's all about playing around. You, you really don't have to know how to play music to do this. But I mean, if, if you could sing and you could dance and you kind of have an idea of rhythm, that really helps a lot. If you can do as much as just tap on your steering wheel when you're listening to music in the car, you could do this. Just kind of start somewhere. Just put your fingers down. You see, I kind of use two fingers a lot. And I'll hold one down and I'll play around a little bit. So try that. It's just one of my techniques. So next, let's try and record this. See what happens. It is kind of silly but I do like it. It's amazing how many cool beats you can come up with just by messing around and making mistakes. The real trick here is to kind of just not be afraid to do anything. It's, it's amazing how many cool ideas you can come up with just by making a bunch of mistakes. You gotta start somewhere. I mean, the method here is simple as Open the app when you're bored and press stuff. Seriously. It's not going to make much sense at first, but then it starts to come together. So you see, I kind of have this drum here and I, I did take down the, I did take down the, the pump. I'll tell you more about that later. So here's another trick with the drums. If you just put your finger down and hold it, and you have a, a four, you know, it's like four, four. Um, it will give you a steady beat. So check it out. I'm just trying to see what's gonna work here. Let's just do four, four. Here we go. Okay, the snare didn't turn out, so we're gonna we're gonna erase that. Just tap the erase button. And then I'm go I'm going in time now. So doom tap doom snare bass snare bass snare. And I kinda like this where just where it is. You see, just just by that, it's it's amazing. Just a simple hi hat. What you can, it can just completely change where the where the whole vibe is going. Simply press and drag right or left, and it changes the sound. So there's, I don't know how many synths, but a lot of synths, and they're very retro and very cool. A lot of times your music will sound like video game music. So I'm jamming. So while I'm jamming, I just want to take a minute to 
telling you guys that one of the reasons why I'm doing this is to show you what I can do for you. Send me a DM, like right now, and ask me about making some cool videos for you. Send me a DM on Instagram. Uh, you can catch me on LinkedIn, just Lyle Trush. You can catch me. <laughs> there I am dancing on my phone. <laughs> um, you can you can email me design at lyletrush.com. D-E-S-I-G-N at lyletrush.com. Be sure to check out my portfolio. Click on the Marvel, uh, the Marvel Comics stuff. Uh, you know the motion graphics. It's all 3D elements, uh, mixing a lot of different elements, just kind of like what I'm doing here. So I do all the composites uh, in After Effects. All right, let's get back to work. There we go. Now I'm following what the bass is doing a little bit. So it, it kind of starts to sync up. It starts to sound like a real song. See with the lead? I'm trying different... You don't have to follow it exactly. Let's click on the mix tab here. I want to show you guys. I'm going to add some of the pump. You do need head you you need headphones to hear this, or you at least need a good stereo system. Uh, you see the blue tab is the drums, the red tab is the bass, and the yellow tab is the lead. You want you do want to be careful when you mix this and make it sound make it sound good. Mixing is very important. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Make Music Anywhere with your iPhone. Please follow me on Instagram. I always answer every single DM. <laughs> <laughs>